This is Dr. Remolina. I'm a practicing pulmonologist in Linden for over 30 years, and I'd like to talk to you about a new procedure called the intrabronchial valve. The intrabronchial valve is a procedure that is not being done in many places, but we are lucky enough to be selected to insert endobronchial valves. This is a procedure that can be used in patients that have a pneumothorax. If you have a spontaneous pneumothorax, or if you have a persistent leak after surgery, sometimes the patient may have to remain in the hospital with a chest tube with pain and suffering for a long period of time. With the use of the endobronchial valve, we can do a bronchoscopy and localize the area where the leak is by in putting a balloon and inflating a balloon to see where the leak is. If we can stop the leak, that's where the leak is. And then by finding out the bronchus where this happens, we can come in with a bronchoscope and deploy a valve to, to prevent the leak from continuing. This valve is a one-way valve, allows the air to come out, but does not allow the air to come into that area. And by doing so, the leak will be stopped, the chest tube be can removed, and the patient can go home. This can remain the patient for a period of time, usually six to eight weeks, sometimes longer depending on the clinical situation. It's a benign procedure, a simple procedure that requires little to no uh, anesthesia or time. The procedure is being done now in one of our hospitals, and if you're interested in finding out about the in endobronchial valve, please call our office and we'll be able to provide such information. Thank you for listening.